In this video, we're going to be controlling a colored smart light using only our brains, or we're going to do that by setting up a brain computer interface with an emotive headset. Now, what you'll need is an emotive headset put on and connected. In this example, I'm going to be using the Insight headset. You'll also need the emotive BCI app set up, as well as training one mental command. In this example, I'm going to be using the push command. And finally, you'll need Node Red set up with Cortex. Now, if you don't have any of these things set up, no worries, that's explained in detail in our previous videos. We're first going to download the LIFX mobile app. Now just install an LIFX colored light bulb to any standard light bulb socket. To add your new light bulb to the LIFX app, connect over Apple Home or over Wi-Fi. Next, we're gonna set up the LIFX Node Red toolbox. If you haven't set up Node Red yet, no worries, there's a previous video that goes over how to do that in more detail. So first we're gonna to go to Node Red in our directory and then install the toolbox with the command here. Next, we're going to generate an LIFX API token so we can actually connect our LIFX light bulb with Node Red. The first thing you're gonna do is go to cloud.lafx.com, log in or create an account, go to the top right, personal access tokens and generate new token. It's important that you copy your token and keep a copy of it somewhere safe. Now we're gonna activate Node Red in the command prompt. and go to this link in the browser. Now we're gonna set up our nodes in Node Red. First, we're gonna start with the emotive node and then going on to a mental command, changing this to push, cause that's the command that we trained and keeping a sensitivity of 10. Next, we're gonna have a threshold node, which is this one here. We're gonna need two of these. The first is gonna be for greater than 50. This means the pushing command is at intensity of greater than 50. Then we're just going to copy and paste that. And the second one, we're going to set to less than 50. Now, once we had installed that LIFX toolbox, you'll notice you have some new nodes down here. We're going to choose LIFX set state, not to be confused with set states. Enter your API token that we generated here, and then choose whichever color you'd like. In this example, we're going to do pink, so that when we think about the pushing command, the light will turn pink and then set fast to true. This will just help the light bulb to change color more quickly. Copy and paste that, and then do the same, but for our non-pushing command, in this case, I'll do green. And then finally, just connecting all the nodes. And now you're all set up in Node Red. The last step is just to click deploy. Now you'll see that the emotive nodes are connecting. You'll want this to say logged in as whatever your name is on your emotive account. And then once you connect your headset, you'll see that this will say getting push data. Now I'm gonna try out the BCI that we set up. So first I'm thinking about neutral and the light is green. Then I start thinking about my push command and the light starts to turn pink. And then finally go back to a neutral command and the light goes green again. We've now set up our Color Light Brain Computer Interface, and I hope this tutorial helps you set up your very own Smart Light BCI.